In Blaine Gwent, steps are being taken to repair the damage caused by the loss of major employers, with sustainability placed firmly at the heart of the development of a former Cora site in Ebbuvale. The works scheme is the redevelopment of the former steelwork site in Ebbuvale, bringing forward in the region of 720 houses, new hospital, new schools, leisure centre, theatre, a new college, environmental resource centre and a general park and feel at the centre of Ebbuvale. Virtually every part of the council, every department has been involved in some way or other because one of the key projects on there now is the new hospital. Uh, so even my social services staff play an active part in regeneration anyway, uh, but they've been involved in the development of the hospital and what services should go in there. And the other sort of de key departments such as technical services have been involved with the consultants and the contractors that we've used on the site to actually remediate it and bring it fit for purpose for construction. One of the things we wanted to do from the start was to integrate as many services as we could onto the site uh, as we felt that would be not only an efficient use of resources but would give people the maximum opportunity to develop. Some of the projects that are ongoing at the moment like the hospital and indeed the general offices are quite exciting in as much as the hospital is a new development but the general offices is part and parcel of the old works which retains the image of the former steelworks site. In this building we're looking at the genealogy and we're trying to bring the genealogy idea alive and to do that we're looking at a number of things. One, we're looking at can we use 3D TVs to bring alive talking picture frames that tell children about the history of the site and also we're looking at bringing in a 5D cinema so the local authority will become the proud possessors of a 5D cinema and this is perhaps a good example where the local authority you know, are prepared to take a risk prepared to look at things outside of the box to showcase future technologies and future applications. The Eisteddfod now, which is coming in 2010, is going to open people's eyes to what the steelworks was like prior to, to closure and indeed the future that we've got now at the moment. We're rapidly making sure that the areas of the site the Eisteddfod need are ready for them to use. We've been piloting social clauses, creating jobs in the construction work and trying to make sure that we get as many local jobs and as much local training as we can out of the scheme. At one stage we are up to 60% local employment and in every contract we really are seeing how can we get local jobs. In the longer term, making sure the schools are involved in the project, making sure that the community actually own it because it is their site and their project for the future. And that long lasting legacy is what we're talking about in terms of the regeneration aspects of the scheme. And a new college on the site, new schools, will take training and skills forward together with the employment that will come onto the site as well as part of the employment areas. So it gives a joined up approach to long term regeneration. What Blaine Gwent and the Welsh Assembly Government are doing here now is creating something which will uh, pave the way for future generations to benefit. Here on the site we're looking at regeneration through sustainability. We've created soil on the site. There was no growing medium. To create the soil We've used green waste from Blaine Gwent and from surrounding authorities that's been processed and then mixed in with colliery shale. So creating a market for council's recycling activities, but also the community can see that the recycling efforts they do are actually coming back to the site to help us create a 20 acre central parkland. So that part of it is also demonstrating that sustainability works. As a former steel worker who has been here for 40 years, I believe that it's, it's a great achievement um, and a great a uh, sense of knowledge knowing that some of the old steelworks is going to remain but also that new projects are going to take place for the future generations. We say here from green to black to green again uh, and that's what we've achieved and if we can get people here the old perception of the valleys of uh, heavily industrialised, heavily scarred land is no longer here. We are green and we want people to come back and enjoy that and also the local communities to enjoy the new, cleaner environment that they now live in.